comparison today between the old style toggle heart bracelet and the new style toggle heart bracelet. Um, I just recently acquired this piece and uh, it's beautiful and I really like the new style but I'm going to speak about the, um, the cons mostly as there's more cons. The only pro I'd say to this new style is aesthetic. It's It looks more beautiful, more elegant in my opinion, but this is what I've noticed between the two. So first of all, obviously the lifesaver bit is thinner. It's not as rounded. It has a flat surface instead of a rounded surface. The toggle bar is thinner and it's not rounded on the edges so they kind of took out that round round factor you see on the very tips of the bar it's more flat flat edges of the bar instead of rounded edges and the new style this part looks much more refined it has the same shaped links as the main bracelet except it's obviously cut down to size but I like how they're thicker and they are uniform it looks a lot more elegant in my opinion it looks less cheap however okay this is the part that really bugged me the most you see this part, the part that links the toggle, hold on a second, the part that links the actual toggle, try to zoom up there, you see how thick that is? The part that's attached to the, um, the lifesaver, it's quite thick. I would never worry that this is going to break. Okay. Now look at the new one. It is so incredibly thin. I feel like it's going to break. Like I'm afraid almost to wear this bracelet because it's so thin. It is the width of an earring. Like an earring, um, you know, the part that goes into your ear. An earring prong. It's so thin. They're set in different... Um, angles this piece is flat now where it used to be perpendicular but look how much thicker the attachment is it's 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 worrying really you see I'm comparing it so they're at the same angle. They're placed on differently now. And you see how much thinner this one is compared to this one. That's really disgusting in my opinion. Not to be mean towards Tiffany, but why would you place something so thin on a big bracelet? It's like kind of a chunky chain bracelet this doesn't look like it's substantial enough to um to hold the thing together and then if you put added charms on and stuff like that i mean how well is it going to really really hold comparing the hearts they've changed the shape over the years the old one this is an older old one where they don't have the uh, tiffany um engraved on the bar but the heart used to be a bit longer and now it's a bit shorter so you can see I wish the thickness of this was on here so I would feel safe for actually wearing it I'm actually very afraid when I wear this bracelet that this is going to start bending and eventually snap off as you can see, the letters are finer. It no longer says 
um, just Tiffany and Company. It says Tiffany and Co. New York. Whereas before it just says Tiffany and Co. And then on the back, it's also engraved on the new. I do really like this piece there. This looks more nautical to me. I don't know why, it just does. Um, this is just kind of, I don't know, a little bit boring. I think this would have been nice, like in the same look, if they kept this shape. But they changed it to a very flat edged bar, which um, resembles most toggle bracelets. Most no name toggle bracelets are flat edged at the side of the bars, which are not, you know, nothing special. Beethoven, enough now. Okay. But yeah, that's my comparison. And if you have any questions about these pieces, please do ask. Do not hesitate to ask. And I will answer all your questions. And I hope you all have a great day. Bye bye.